So, welcome to episode one of Gardener's Plot. Uh, this episode, I'll introduce you to the animals, the garden, and what the plan is for the garden. And uh, excuse the mess behind me. This is one of the jobs to be done. Um, so yeah, you ready for the ride? Let's go. So first up is my little boy Teddy. There he is. He's my little boy. I'm gonna hold you during the winter because during the summer you get a bit fruity. So yeah, he's my little boy. We went, got him at a wedding, as you do. Go to a wedding, come in with a ferret. Sounds like a good deal to me. So yeah, that's a little introduction to Teddy. So as we leave the shed, this we come into the wildlife garden. This was all actually just a lawn when we moved in. And then in the year, I managed to put my fern garden in so hopefully we'll extend this all the way up to the up here and this hopefully will be a stream you can sort of see the basic outline going down into our pond which is brand new this year it's really got fish and frogs and everything in it it's doing really well hopefully come springtime it'll everything come back to life so plant some more ferns up along the pathway Again, like I said, get the stream on the go. So yeah, that's the pond. Well, fern garden if you like. Got a little mushroom. Some temporary seating, so we can enjoy it. Some of the kids in the background. So yep, yeah, that's one part of the wildlife garden. Now this is an aviary. I say aviary, like it contains ferns, but it actually doesn't. So let's go in and see what it is. This is Saskia. She has been out a minute ago, she is getting a bit grumpy because it is winter, so she might not come out. Let's see if she does. There she is. No, no, she's going back in because it's cold. I'll get some video of her later on. But you can... She's normally cuddly, but today it's cold, so she's upset. So we'll leave her to it. So during the winter obviously everything dies back so but there's plans to have lots of other sort of forest plants in here, sort of snowdrops and bluebells and things like that. Also along the border hopefully there's some wild garlic will come up soon so that will spread. So here's the pond. It's not doing too badly so it was like I said like a little lawn. Still a bit of work to do but that will come in later on. Doesn't look like much now, but this will be a wild meadow. Yeah, this is the border. Wild for lots of wild plants, native, and to encourage bees and butterflies and things like that. You can really see some of the things sprouting up through. Let's rock in the back of the garden just to sort of split it up. Nice big secure fence to stop these little delightful children getting through. It's a veg plot. So I did grow some stuff last year, it seemed to work, so this year I'm going to do everything properly. And it's basically what the videos are going to be about, is the progress of the garden. So there is a lot of work, a little bit of rhubarb there, coming back to life, and some berry bushes. So hopefully in the next couple of videos you'll see some improvement here. Also have the greenhouse. Yeah, very, uh, hopefully I'll be sorting this out this weekend, so... Hopefully next video will be a bit more organised and I've got some plastic green ashes to go inside, so replacing the glass. As you can see it's very open. Alright, and this is down to the other part of the garden, our lovely lawn. We've been trying to save all the rainwater, so we'll put that to use next year when we start needing to water in plants and things, always recycle. This was a herb garden, so hopefully it will come back to life in the spring and I'll plant some more stuff. And hopefully we'll get going all the way along. So like I said, there's a little bit of work to do. Lovely lawn, which won't be a lawn forever. We are going to plan on graveling it and make it a bit more of a social space. If the kids behave in or not. <laughs> That's Moo in the background. Maddie! That's our Maddie Moo Moo. Chickens. Lots of chickens. So these guys come out for a wander on the weekend. That's a lot of Spartacus, or Sparty for short. Sure. A young man lover, which is little Falco, who rules the garden. That's Boston. Oh, that's Leo. Oh, you good boy. Yes. 
So yes, still a little bit of work to do in this part, but hopefully you'll see the progress through the videos. This will be all planted up as well with herbs, so the animals can graze through the mesh. This is the outdoor paddock of the chickens. It is a little bit messy at the moment, but this all goes back onto the garden. So I let the chicken trample it down a little bit. And then every two weeks it goes onto the garden to go down as manure and things like that and on compost. And that's the house. So the rabbits share this with the chickens. They don't seem to mind. They get on quite well. Although Spike likes to eat most of the food before anyone else gets it. But yeah, so there you go. That's pretty much the garden explained. So hopefully this year it will be Coming to like, I'm waiting for spring for anything to come in really and try and keep the animals off. So, I'm going to try and fence a few things off to keep it organized. But hopefully, we'll have a wildlife garden and veg plot harmonized so hopefully, it all comes in together. So, yeah, that's the garden. Yeah, episode one done. That's how I mean. Um, trap ended. No, ready. That's the kids. All right, hello, hello. So yes, that's the basically what we're gonna do in the garden. So hopefully, it works. I know there's some little videos or tutorials and things like that of how to try and build. Well, try and build things. Um, also some other little DIY projects that I've got planned. So yeah, so hopefully next episode we'll have the greenhouse sorted. I say that like I pro I'll probably will get it done, but hopefully we'll get it sorted. And a few things started off seedling. Seedling? Some seedling started off. So yeah, if you want to follow the story, subscribe, like, and press the little bell button thing for notifications. My life isn't that interesting, but who knows, you might get a few tips. I'm not an expert, but yeah. So we'll see what happens. Enjoy.